the way the balls are going in, it's painful. Where before we were rigid, I feel like now we're porous. But this was a game where I felt like we were in control for large portions of this game and just didn't capitalize and then gave up two what I felt like were soft goals. We spend a lot of time in training. We do a lot of eight V6s in the final third, looking for a great opportunity on goal and, and the movements that we're looking for. Unfortunately, training is not Saturday. There's no fans, there's no pressure, and there's no scoreline. And I, I think you have to have ice in your veins to allow the game that's going at 100 miles an hour to slow down and be clinical in that spot. In other words, you have to be two or three plays ahead and can't be upset at what we've been creating in the last three games. Can't be upset at our XG. Can't be upset at how much of the ball we have. And in the end of the day, I think the guys are doing everything they can to put the ball in the back of the net. And for whatever reason, their goalkeeper's making saves. They're getting good blocks at bright times. And, and we just gotta keep moving forward. The mentality to keep pushing, to keep driving, everything's there. You know, I think this year in particular, we've done a fantastic job of going from our goal to their goal with some good ideas and some good movements. Um, but obviously, as you get closer to the goal, the field condenses. Uh, teams do a good job of packing that box and, and we'll just keep working on that final third and that final decision until we get it right.